हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू इन न्यूज़ प्रोग्राम टुडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज उधम सिंह अ मैन हु टुक द रिवेंज पॉइंट्स ऑफ डिस्कशन विल बी द न्यूज अर्ली लाइफ पॉलिटिकल इन्वॉल्वमेंट कैक्सटन शूटिंग एंड प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चन फॉर प्रिलिम्स एग्जाम फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल मूविंग ऑन टू द न्यूज नेशन ऑन जुलाई थर्टी फर्स्ट विल मार्क द एटी थर्ड डेथ एनिवर्सरी ऑफ उधम सिंह उधम सिंह इज नोन फॉर शूटिंग डेड माइकल ओ जॉयर एट द मीटिंग ऑफ द ईस्ट इंडिया एसोसिएशन एंड द रॉयल सेंट्रल एशियन सोसाइटी एट द कैक्सटन हॉल इन लंडन उधम सिंह इज ऑल्सो नोन एज शहीद आजम सरदार उधम सिंह विच मीन्स ग्रेट मैचायर नाउ लेट्स डिस्कस अबाउट हिज अर्ली लाइफ उधम सिंह वॉज बॉर्न शेर सिंह इन टू अ सिख फैमिली ऑन ट्वेंटी सिक्स डिसम्बर एटीन नाइन्टी नाइन इन सुनाम लाहौर He was orphaned at a young age and was raised up in Central Khalsa orphanage. During the World War II, Udham Singh joined Indian lowest ranking labor unit of British Indian Army with the 32nd Sikh Pioneers. While in army, he was involved in railway restoration work in Basra. Political involvement affected by Jallianwala Bagh massacre, he became inclined towards revolutionary politics. He came under the influence of revolutionaries like Bhagat Singh. In 1924, Singh became involved with the Gadar Party, organizing Indians overseas towards overthrowing colonial rule. In 1927, he was arrested for the possession of unlicensed revolvers, ammunition, and copies of a prohibited Gadar Party paper called Gadri Gunj. He was convicted and sent to jail for five years. After his release from the jail he escaped from India via Kashmir to Germany he reached London and gained employment there in London he was affiliated with Indian Workers Association Caxton shooting on 13 March 1940 Udham Singh killed Michael O'Dwyer who was scheduled to speak at joint meeting of the East Indian Association and the Central Asian Society at Caxton Hall London Michael O'Dwyer was the lieutenant governor of Punjab during Jallianwala Bagh massacre. Singh shot O'Dwyer twice as he moved towards the platform. One of these bullets passed through O'Dwyer's heart and right lung, killing him almost instantly. While in custody, he called himself Ram Muhammad Singh Azad, representing three religious communities of Punjab. While the last word Azad reflects his anti-colonial sentiment. Singh was convicted of murder and sentenced to death. On 31st July 1940, Singh was hanged at Pentonville Prison. His remains are preserved at the Jallianwala Bagh in Amritsar, Punjab. After his conviction, he gave the speech which was prohibited by the judge to be released in the press. It was however released by efforts of Indian Workers Association. Now it's time for the practice question. Consider the following statements. One General Dyer responsible for Jallianwala Bagh massacre was killed in Caxton shooting. Two Udham Singh was responsible for the Caxton shooting. Three Udham Singh was the member of Indian National Congress and HSRA. Which of the following statements is or are correct? One only, two only, one and two only or one and three only? send the answer of this question in the comment section stay tuned for the next episode thanks for watching